Volvo F8. That looks the absolute dog style, I mean, that looked good, doesn't it? The Volvo F8 with iSave is massively improved, so we decided to let our customer MDF Transport give it a try. We run a fleet of 22 Volvo trucks and we run around about 55 trailers, various shapes and sizes, extendable trailers, low loaders, step frame trailers to do specialist transport. Obviously working in this area with our backs against the coast, we're working in a 180 degrees area rather than a 360 degrees area. Having the right truck with the right power and to be able to get good fuel consumption starting from here is very important. Good, so we finally got the new truck here. Shall yes. we, uh, shall we have a look at it? Yeah, good look, it looks good. It does, doesn't it? It's got a new drive line fitted to it, so we've got the latest turbo compound uh, Steppy engine. We've also got the new safety features as well. Yeah, is that uh, what the new side scan is? Yeah, so SCAS, side collision avoidance support. And in terms of aerodynamics, we've also closed up all the gaps, so that yeah, improves the airflow okay. again. So again, it will have an impact on the improved fuel consumption. So the test will last for six months. This truck will do around about 750 kilometers per day on a mixture of single carriageways, dual carriageways, uh, various different speeds, quite often at full weight. How does it feel? It feels, well, it feels comfortable, yes. It feels homely, it feels homely. I think we should give it, give it a run, see how it is. I love the, uh, the display. I was having a look there just before we left. It does pull well. It does pull well, from what I've seen so far. It's quiet as well, isn't it? Really quiet. Yeah, first impressions, it's very promising. Obviously today's the first day that the, the truck's been delivered, so it'll go to work tonight, and then hopefully we'll get some great feedback in the next few weeks. I take it up to North Yorkshire, where I do a changeover from a boy who comes down from the central belt in Scotland, and then a third drive will take it up to Aberdeen. He starts at six o'clock and he'll work that truck through till six o'clock the following morning. It is a challenging route and the roads aren't the best. Most people would hate it, but I love it. It's a long night, but do you know what? I'd much rather be doing this than, you know, delivery here, delivery there, and you're going all over the place. I'd much rather just leave. Off you go, four and a half hours, and then straight back. I know exactly what I'm doing every day. Get the tunes going. So we're back today at MDF Transport. The truck's been in for a couple of months now, so we're going to review the figures with Mark and see just how well the truck's done over the last few months. So we've got the reference truck. Yep. Uh, which we've got, plus the new truck. Yes. And then as you can see, if you look at all the numbers for each of the different weeks, overall we've got an improvement on fuel of 5%. Wow. How does that sound? Wow. Impressive, isn't it? We had a good feeling about this truck, but to really to get to see them figures in black and white with Martin today, savings between 5 and 6% on fuel, which is incredible, really exciting. And especially with the cost of fuel at the moment, it's doubly important and good feeling, exciting. It's a brilliant been? drive. Um, it's the easiest truck I've ever driven. The gear, but I've noticed is actually quicker changes. Yeah. I noticed that straight away. And when you need, need the power, it's there. Right. But likewise, if you're going for the fuel, it will. It'll really dig in deep on the hills. It'll keep you in you just top to gear. gear a lot longer, yeah, it? it does, yeah. It's, I mean, short story, do I have to give it back? I mean, it, it's, it's- At some point, I'm afraid, yes. You've <laughs> outdone yourselves with this one. I mean, I've been driving lorries only six years, but already seeing the progression culminating in this thing, you've really done a good job with this. What you produce when you're operating a transport company is hundreds of things. The truck you run, how you conduct yourself. Our customers expect us to have the best equipment. Um, and you still filming? It gives me pleasure. It gives me pleasure, it gives me a buzz to buy the best spec truck for the guys who work hard. That's, that's important. <laughs>